All new at 5, insight into the murder of a rapper at an Atlanta music studio. Channel 2's Ryan Young live in Southeast Atlanta. With how detectives now say it all started over a piece of candy. Ryan? Now, Justin, we actually got rare access to this story today. I want to show you this. This is the piece of candy. They sell several items like this inside the studio. And apparently, the rapper grabbed a piece like this from another man inside. They got to arguing over it. Then it started a fight. Then led to a shooting. He was actually shot. Right where I'm standing. I got rare access to a crime scene this afternoon in hopes of helping to catch a killer. Victor Mario Hamilton, known uh, in the rap community and recording industry as Slim Duncan. Slim Duncan, a young up-and-coming artist, was shot and killed at this recording studio on Memorial Drive this past Friday. Veteran homicide detective David Quinn shows me where the rapper was before he was shot. Slim Duncan was inside this particular room when, according to witnesses, someone came in, struck him, and a fight ensued. Now, the information we're getting, and it's unconfirmed, but witnesses are saying that this whole thing started over a piece of candy. A piece of candy that looks like what I'm holding in my hand. Duncan, who stood six foot eight, was bigger than his attacker. That man then ran and got a gun and shot Slim Duncan. This fight spilled out into this area where he was attacked and beat. Based on the evidence that we have, whoever he was fighting with, secured a weapon and shot him, whereupon he landed in this table area. That night, the studio was packed because another artist was supposed to shoot a video here. There were at least 20 or 30 people in this studio at the time. Now, the fact that Atlanta police arrived on call to Grady Hospital first, we didn't have the opportunity to speak to any of those people. We came here almost an hour and a half later. Now, they came an hour and a half later because the folks here at the studio drove Slim Duncan to Grady Hospital. Now, what they're hoping is some of the people here will contact police and give them the information they need so they can catch this killer. But I can tell you, in all the years I've been covering homicides, I don't ever remember someone getting killed over a piece of candy. We're live in Southeast Atlanta. Ryan Young, Channel 2 Action News. Anyone with information, please call Crime Stoppers 404-577-TIPS. 404-577-8477. You don't have to give your name, but could still be eligible for a reward.